Hello, welcome to the Regional Transportation Plan Online Open House. I'm Jin Kim, Senior Planner in Transportation Planning. I'm joined here by Kim Pearson, Associate Planner for this presentation. We are here today to provide an overview of the Coordinated Mobility Plan. The Coordinated Mobility Plan is part of the PSRC's Regional Transportation Plan. This plan addresses the mobility needs of people with special transportation needs, including youth, older adults, people with disabilities, and people with low incomes. Currently, almost half of the region's population falls into at least one of these demographic groups. Mobility needs are typically addressed by a variety of public transportation options. Mobility options that people with special transportation needs rely on include regular transit, such as service provided by bus, rail, and ferries, and specialized transportation services that fill in gaps for those who cannot use the regular transit system. Examples of specialized transportation include ADA paratransit vans provided by transit agencies that help transport people with disabilities, and community shuttles or vans that typically require advanced booking for a ride. More information on these mobility options can be found in the Coordinated Mobility Plan. To identify the key mobility needs of the populations mentioned, PSRC organized online engagement activities at community meetings, engaging over 570 people. Here are the key mobility needs we heard via both community meetings and surveys. Shorter travel times when taking regular transit or specialized transportation, more transportation services at times when they are needed, more information about available services, better access to health and wellness destinations, affordable transportation services, and more connected ADA accessible infrastructure like sidewalks and curb ramps. PSRC then worked with stakeholders to develop and prioritize strategies or actions to address the key mobility needs. Meanwhile, staff developed related performance measures to track the progress of each strategy. Moving forward, PSRC will continue to work with partners on refining and implementing the prioritized strategies and performance measures. Additionally, PSRC will continue other regional coordination efforts around mobility for people with special transportation needs. Please check out the links either below this video or to the right where you can find all of the details of the Coordinated Mobility Plan. We'd love to hear your comments and ideas, so please click on the button below this video to leave feedback or through the main website comment form. All comments that we receive will be summarized and presented to the PSRC Transportation Policy Board, a group of elected and appointed officials and other community, business, labor, and environmental leaders as they refine and make changes to the plan this spring. We expect adoption of the plan in May 2022. Thank you for visiting our online open house and please check out the other topics on this website. <laughs>